TNT Dynam idea explosive when I'm the man on the sticks. And I got framey there for a second. We're playing Hollow Knight. Uh, last episode, I went to fall the, fight the Mawelk a couple times, and he was difficult. So I took a couple of new uh, abilities, actually. I took the uh, Balder Shield, which gives me a shell that is indestructible, or not an indestructible, but it gives me a shell that protects me from damage while I'm healing. And I kept the steady body, but I took off the charm that gives me extra soul. <clears throat> it seems like uh, just having that extra degree of security while trying to heal on this boss may be useful. So we're going to give it a shot with this setup. We're rocking a whole new build, but our uh, you know our our will and, and desire to uh, to win has not been shaken. But I'm not one to keep beating my head up against the wall. I'm going to attack it from an intellectual standpoint. So I feel good right now. I feel like we we have a a decent shot. Had beaten this guy. That has become second nature to me. Shit. That's unfortunate. <laughs> Look at that. Little shields. I mean, I guess I could check and see what's over here. It doesn't look like it's anything, though. Let, let's, let's take a quick check. Let's take a quick peek. I'm not sitting on that many, uh, I almost called them souls. I'm not sitting on that many, uh, Geo if I were to die again, honestly. There was a thing here the whole time. It was there the whole god dang time. No. Speaking of Geo, <laughs> oh, hand it over to Papa Bear. A lot, of, a lot of people get weirded out when I call myself Daddy or Papa Bear. It doesn't weird me out in the least. <laughs> I've, I've told the people on countless occasions that I would prefer to be called Daddy. I've thought of legally changing my name to Daddy. I mean, obviously, you know, there's a, a little bit of jest in that, but... I mean, it'd be a cool name, right? Alright, big boy. Oh my god, there's just nothing I can do against this guy. He blasted through my shield! What can you do? Alright, that did allow me some... Ability. Please. Oh god. Alright, need to heal. 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 No! Heal! Heal! Alright, we're, do we're doing alright. We're doing alright. He's definitely keeping us where he wants us, though. Please. Alright, alright. No! I was gonna heal right after that! Man, I don't know. I feel it's almost like we're missing something that's keeping us from killing this guy. I don't know. But uh, I'm, I'm happy with, with the way that fight went over the, the other fights that we had had against that guy. It was definitely a, a step in the right direction. I just I don't know what else we got to bring to the table here. Perhaps just like performance... Staying away from him. I mean, we can't deal any damage if we're too far away. That's that's my my issue. 
We gotta get in there because we gotta be offensively savvy. Maybe I'm missing the savvy element. Sometimes the best offense is a good offense, you know? But sometimes I gotta salivate. So I'm gonna be sal I'm gonna be sal salacious. Salivatory. I'm gonna be savvy this time. We're gonna think and we're gonna move in accordance to the way that a thinking man would. The brain is mightier than the sword. Alright. We do not need to get any of our focus back at all. We're basically full. Alright, cool. Alright, we're going in here again. Oh my god. No. I thought he was gonna jump. I need to heal. I need to heal again. Alright. Oh, we need to move. Why do you have to have the high ground at all times? At least, you know, the thing is that I'm not taking damage when my shield gets man maneuvered when I, sh when I lose my shield. God damn it, I should have healed. Move. 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 I think I got it. I'm gonna heal. It didn't hurt me when he did that. Move. Heal up. Oh, I don't need to heal up. I do need to move over. I think I got it. I see the matrix now. Heal. Alright, that's okay. That's okay. We can take a couple hits. We can take a couple hits, but not too many more. Let's heal up as much as we can. That's okay. Let's heal up. Oh my god, what happened to my shield? What happened to my shield? I had it, now it doesn't exist. You know what? We were seeing the ones and zeros. We were we were we were moving with purpose and every every jump kind of mattered. I mean, ultimately it led to us dying anyway, but I figured it out like halfway through there. We we got you. <laughs> it's bad news. Bad this run right here, bad news for him because now we know. I saw I saw the code. You know, he's using C sharp and and I was operating under JavaScript. But now that I know I'm gonna hit him with a little bit of that frostbite engine. I, I know nothing about programming. I don't know if that's 100% clear to you. Not a bit. Like I go, I go to Reddit and I, I look at the programming humor. I don't know what any of that shit means. That shit might as well be in a different language. I tell you what, I do know. I do know how to how to say that never say die attitude. That's what I know how to do. And you're like, well, dynamite. If you never say die, where's where's that Dark Souls playthrough? Don't you bring up Dark Souls? We're playing Hollow Knight. Why aren't we talking about Dark Souls? All right, he's not that hard. He's kind of hard. Got to jump to the other side when he does that. All right, we're gonna heal up. No, we're not. We're gonna heal up. Oh, bullshit. All right. S 
Stop spitting stuff! Do I come to your house and spit stuff? Oh god. I need to get over here and I need to heal immediately. I still need to heal. It's gonna be one of those episodes, huh? <laughs> one, of, one of the first bosses I have to bang my head up against more than once or twice. It's all right. We had to fight the uh, the nail chick. We had to fight the the nail chick a bunch of times. I don't remember how many times. I don't think it was this many. I think I beat her like my third or fourth try. And this has been like maybe my fifth with this boy. You know, honestly, I, I welcome the challenge. I've got a never back down attitude. I don't want to hear a word about Dark Souls 2 either. Oh my god, where did you all even come from? It's like a goddamn gathering of the juggalos over here as soon as I decide to jump. And you're still over here trying to trying to jam me up. Everybody just wants to jam me up. All right, I I need that focus, please. Could you just give me a little bit? That'll do. Ooh, threading a needle. back again we're gonna try it again I'll give it a few more tries I'm not I'm not adverse to that sometimes you do need to put the stick down and just come back to it with new eyes and if that if that be the case that be the case I'm all well my dude how many abilities do you have my dude heal Perfect, that's what I love you to do that. Over here. Two hits. <laughs> your boy. Do you see your boy? Do you, do you see him fail? Gonna heal twice. How are you jumping so many times? What is your deal? You've never jumped that much. Never jumped that much. All of a sudden, that's all you know how to do is jump. Huh? Heal. Heal twice. Get over here. Get over there. Oh, we're, we're doing good stuff here. Until that happened. Heal. over there get over here now all right all right all right I'm quiet but I'm gonna be quiet sometimes heal no Please, just, just die already, dude. Please. Alright. No. Not like this. Not like this.
heal. Alright. No! No? I beat him! <laughs> you absolute moron. <laughs> oh, and a second piece of my face mask. Alright, before we go forward... Only to solidify the fact of I don't play games here. To play games. We're gonna go up here and we're gonna heal up completely. Oh, oh I was seeing the Matrix though. You saw me seeing it. <laughs> you, you saw it happening. <laughs> and another one bites the dust. Alright, good fight though. Good fight. I was really concerned for our, for our safety there at some points in time, but you know you're not talking to your average everyday video gamer, man. I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna succeed when the chips are down. I just think of all the little Hulkamaniacs out there that want me to succeed, and even the ones that want me to fail. And we rise to the occasion. And seriously, that was all just for that mask. That was an optional boss? Oh, what the fuck? Now I don't know what to do. Alright, well, before we got locked into that, uh... <laughs> that battle of attrition, our plan was to go back to Green Path and see if there was anything there that we could, uh... access with our newly found mobility. So I guess that's what we'll do. You bitch. I love how, like, the brainless enemies are, like, tearing my asshole apart right now. Pardon the, uh, <laughs> the, the idiom. You guys never use that in your neighborhood? <laughs> when something was really difficult. No, it's not, not one you're familiar with? All the time. My, my whole family, we're always talking about how things are tearing our assholes apart. This is the way we. That's the way we get down. Like, yeah. How, how was the traffic outside, honey? Oh my God! They tore my asshole apart. Oh, give me my money. I've helped so many of your friends. Oh, okay. There's another one over here. I may save this money and just open up a bank account. But I, I have a strong feeling that, like, a nail smith is to come. I use that terminology only because it's a terminology that has been provided to me towards the game. I do not want to incite a riot like I've been cheating. This is basically a blind run. I mean, I don't know if you've noticed, but I've been walking around wandering aimlessly for, like... Yeah, like, look, look at this. If this doesn't prove it's blind, I don't know what does. I went the wrong way. Alright, we gotta go to the left here. Don't be a dick. Yeah, okay, so this is, yeah, this is Green Path. Alright, cool. Music should change. Can I get some, uh, can I get some upbeat music, please? Can I go this way at all? Do I need something to go this way? No, this is where I came from, right? No, that's a bench. That is not a bench. Oh my god, I'm, I'm I swear to you. I do have a short-term memory. And somewhat of a long-term one. I may not showcase them video to video, but you know, the, the, the thoughts the thoughts are kind of like all over the place here. Oh, that is a jam right there. That song right there, absolute bang. <laughs> What are you, just climbing the wall? 
Can't do that. Trying to see if there's anything over here I can get to. It doesn't really look like it. Oh, you're gonna blow up. Don't forget that. Stop on your left foot. Don't forget it. And you bring it around town. Okay, let's keep moving. I mean, worst comes to worst, I might find a secret that I, was, I didn't have access to prior. There is a bench up here. You want a bench up? It's a bench up. I don't mind benching up. Uh, in fact, I'm going to change my abilities back to... I do kind of like this shell, though. But I just, I really don't see where I would get use out of it when I'm not fighting, like, a boss. So we'll just go for more focus so I can, uh, I can spam my abilities a little bit more. Is that, they were hiding money back there, did you see that? Thought they could trick us. Yeah, some trickery for you, like, look at, look at this dude. Alright, do you see this, this this pillar right here? I'm standing, it's behind me. Why does everything in the background have to look like a dick? I mean, honestly, I don't know if the developers were just like, they are like, hey dude, go for it. Let's see how many penises we can toss into the game. Ho ho ho! It's like if Jonas was a developer. can only imagine how many dicks he'd throw in the mix. You let him know that, too. You, you tell him I said that. He's not here right now. He can't defend himself. You let him know that I said he's the dick guy. Jones has been a dick boy ever since I know him. I'm told. <laughs> he knows it's all love, though. I'm sure, I'm sure he, he understands. Ooh, oh, I can achieve great heights. All right, so now, wait, let, what is over there? Let, let's see what's over here. I know I didn't really uh, elaborate on where I'm going, but I think it's pretty clear. There is, if I go down from here and to the right, there's that area that it was inaccessible to me. And I tend, I aim to find out why it was inaccessible. Oh my god. Oh my god. Everybody stop. Stop what you're doing and leave me a be. Alright, so it should be... I really hate these guys. It should be one more... Oh, one more level down. Yeah, well, I think this pretty much explains it. Oh! Suddenly lightning. Now I recall. Though, I can make it up here now. Okay. Okay, I might be able to do this. The slide was a little early. I don't want to die, though, so let's just die, I guess. Alright, we need, we need to get some focus. We need to get some... Oh! Good thing we benched up. <laughs> oh my god, it's such a long walk. So, uh, I don't know. Like, let's, let's get into some me and Jonas backstory. This is, this is a story that we don't tell too often on anything. Mainly because, you know, like, uh, I don't know, we don't really get into it. So I'll tell it from my point of view, and then if you want to know from Jonas, you can ask him from his point of view. From my point of view, though, I remember 
uh, I moved from Cleveland, Ohio, to a small podunk town in, uh, I'm going the wrong way, in, uh, I guess it's like northeastern Ohio, but Cleveland's kind of northeastern Ohio, but uh, it was Ashtabula. I went to Ashtabula High School, which no longer exists, so don't even at me trying to pull up like old images of TNT Dynamite. Plus, my name was not TNT Dynamite, nor is my real name TNT Dynamite, but you can just call me TNT Dynamite or Daddy. Um, but while I was there, I had made friends with uh, some of the locals, and I mean, let's just keep it real, they were kind of nerdy. You know, into Magic the Gathering, into like, uh, you know, like trauma films and stuff of that nature. And needless to say, I too am now into these, uh, these variable sources and mediums of, of entertainment. <laughs> I've definitely played more than my fair share of Magic. I've actually done like even some tournament play, but never with like any, like, uh, notable success. But you put a deck in front of me. In fact, this is totally like a tangent, but in fact, I went over to a, a friend of mine's house. I go there and I play D and D on Saturdays, and we were playing Magic the Gathering this day. And he just put like an open box with like mostly commons. There was like maybe like two or three rares, and I just made a I made a deck, and then within like within like a uh, I don't know 45 minutes. I made a, a comprehensive deck that I was able to, to beat uh, the majority of the people there with. And like, uh, we were playing like four-headed dragon shit. But uh, you know, I felt pretty good about that. It was like, it was mostly commons, but it just had like, it had synergies and it had an underlying theme to it. And I was just able to create that basically out of thin air. Or out of thin cards for that matter. But yeah, when I got when I got to this town, I it was it was a little bit different than what I was used to. I really hate these guys. But uh, you know, eventually I met up with these guys. They were kind of nerdy, and then I met up with uh, with another friend of mine. We'll call him uh, Brock, just to save him the embarrassment. But me and Brock. He was the brother of one of the, the dudes that I hung out with. And him being a little bit older than me, he was the older brother. Him being a little bit older than me, I was just like, oh, so this guy is just, I am pressing the wrong button to do the dash. And thus have lost myself two hearts. I'm still pressing the wrong button. My God. But he was a cooler guy, you know, and he could get alcohol and stuff, so <laughs> who isn't going to want to hang out with that guy? <laughs> and then through him, I met what, I guess, for lack of a better term, I would just call the, the Astrobula family. Very similar to the Juggalos, and a majority of them actually did enjoy ICP, so... Not too far off. All right, I'm going to try it with this. Right trigger is the button that jams you forward, though. Mother of frickin' pearl. Dude, I don't want to go in there with three with three strikes. I don't want to go in there with two strikes. This is not looking good for your boy. All right, I just need to build up some focus. Oh, he's back. This is a good focus boy right here. No! I tapped it instead of holding it. That's what she said. You should always hold it, girls. Never tap it. No. No! I'm gonna die to the enemies! Where'd you go? Alright, I need at least one more heart before I feel comfortable doing this. Might actually be good for me to be doing less damage at this point. Because though I am dealing less damage, I'm getting more focus when I hit things multiple times. Something to take into consideration. 
I jumped out of the... My enemy's back. They are. This is beautiful. The dream has been realized. I would like more focus if you could make that happen too. Oh, 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 oh. You've given me the kings to the kingdom. You don't even know what you've done. And these guys are still going good. I was really concerned they were going to hit me again. Alright. Kill this boy. In fact, that's enough. I don't even need to kill you. Alright. We're full on everything. This gives me the best chance that I've had so far to get through this. R button is the button you want to press. R button. Not your button. Hmm. I may be able to make a, a slight hop. That is not going to do it. God, help me. Alright, alright. Why is it that I want to slide and I don't? Oh! Okay, alright. Time your jumps. What does it get me? Thorns of Agony. Senses the pain of the bear and lashes out at the world around them. When taking damage, sprout tiny vines, thorny vines, <laughs> that damage nearby foes. Cool, cool, cool. We did it, boys. We freaking did it. They doubted me. I doubted me. But we managed to do it. Alright, well, that's probably going to end it for this episode. Um, we're tying up some loose ends, but honestly, we're no closer to uh, where the hell we're supposed to go next. I kind of feel like it's probably just that, uh, that mushroom land where we were. But I don't mind tying up these loose ends, getting into some commentary about me and Jonas, which I totally did not tell any more of that story. Let's just say that Jonas was a part of the Ashabula family, man. We just hung out and we did way too many drugs back then. And, you know, honestly, we, we made it out. And every day I have to be thankful that I'm no longer in Ashabula. <laughs> Dude, I've, I've, I've lost a lot of friends to some, some, questionable, uh, some questionable things, man. So, me and Jonas made it. Now we're, we're still alive here today to delivers some high quality entertainment either way um we've got tons of content on our channel jonas is doing his solo thing go over and check that out check out our collaborative efforts because that's the real meat and potatoes of what the crazy town is is when we get together and do shit you know um if you feel like making us a permanent fixture of your daily routine, be sure to click that subscribe button, man. We're here to enrich your lives. Um, and, and, you know, leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Leave a like if you didn't enjoy the video. Jonas would say a lot of your friends. I agree with him wholeheartedly. Uh, until then, or at least until tomorrow, this is TNT Dynamite, and I'm out.